Hi, back again for another vlog, but a vlog with a little bit of a difference. So I've decided I'm going to take us for a little journey. Not too far because the weather is rubbish again. So I'm going to take you to which you may have seen it actually before, just for a few minutes. I'm gonna take you to the Bat Cave. Yes, the Bat Cave. So, come and join me in the Bat Cave. This is where I'm gonna show you my other trainers. So, I thought we could do the vlog in here today. Why not? Why have not? Although it is a tad cold. I'm not gonna lie, it's a bit cold. So, this is it. Yes, I showed you not too long ago. Uh, this is where all, I keep all my trainers. Uh, it's a bit of a mess, because I've been bringing stuff in and out. Um, but yes, also my record boxes, because I love my uh, records vinyl um so yeah so i thought i'd come in and uh, have a chat with you in here Brr, although it's bloody cold um anyway yeah so how are you today how's things going um gotta be honest as i always am um i've been in and doing a lot of questioning of life Sometimes I don't think that is probably the best thing you can do. But um, where am I going? What am I doing? What's gonna What's gonna happen in twenty years' time? You know all that malarkey. Hmm. But I'm gonna. I'm trying not to go too deep into that because oh, I think if you let yourself go too deep, you. Yeah, it's not always a good thing to do. So, instead of doing that today, let's have a look at some more sneakers. S sneakers, that was a mixture of trainers and sneakers. Trainers, sneakers, kicks, whatever you want to call them. Let's have a look at some more. So, I said I'd show you some of my vans, the ones that I wear sort of more on a daily basis. So, these ones, I don't wear a lot, but the kind of ones that I don't mind getting a bit knackered. They're all right, they're okay. They're not great at this time of year, because, you know, I can't say they're the warmest things I've ever had. Um, let me see if I can put you down here for a minute. There we go. Too bad, is it? Hey, that's better. Right. Um, yeah, these ones. Not, as I say, they're not really the most warm in the world. But they're, you know, they're all right. They're, they're better in the summer. Um, and then these ones. Again, I would say not the warmest, but the nice with, you know, in the summer with a nice pair of jeans, that kind of thing. Um, look at here. These ones are better because they've got a bit of a furry line. I like these. These are the ones I've probably worn the most, actually. And then, um, let's get some more out. Should do, I should have done this before. I don't know why I didn't think of it. And then it's, you know, and then I, I could have just gone through them. These ones. I like these. These are what, these are quite warm. It's quite thick, more of a wintry line. 
so I'll wear these ones quite a bit. Yep, like those. And then, so they, I think those are the vans. I'm not sure those are all my vans. <coughs> These, oh, some more dunks. Hey, there we go. Another pair of dunks for you. These, I'm, I'm gonna guess, these are 2003. No, they're earlier. These little beauties are 2002. These, I've got to say, I think these were my first dunks I ever bought. Quite thick, so they're very much, they're that thick tongue. Very much like an SB actually. But these, oh, I, I wore these to death, as you can see. These I've got to say were my first ones and love these. Absolutely love them. Brilliant. So nice, it's so nice to actually see, you know, the original labels, you know, and the um the box, you know, this old box so many of these old boxes um, and one thing actually one kick I wanted to show you it's not a Nike it's not Vans it's not Adidas it's not Puma and you're thinking now well, what the bloody hell is it it is Etnies now these were Slam City Skates uh, limited edition Etnies faction Slam City Skates faction kicks. Yeah, I'm not overly familiar with Etnies to be honest, but these are. Oh, I love these, and I've still got the original bits and bobs. And again, I've worn these to death. These little beauties. These are so so comfortable they had slam city in the lining as you can see there and in the uh, in the sole so that was i think yeah i think that was for their 20 year birthday was it for their 20 year birthday it may well have been um and it's on the tongue as well as you can see there and you got two sets of laces, three including the white. So you got grey and orange, eh, grey and orange, grey and green. And you got a bag as well, cool little bag, dust bag. I mean, these are knackered now. I might give them a bit of a clean up with my pret, eh, pret. I can't talk today, what's going on? My crep. Might give them a bit of a clean up. Um, see how well they come out but because these, these are great I love these I really do and they are so worn you can see where it's all cracking and the on the sole um, but I will try and salvage them as I say you know they they quite limited those they've done quite a few actually uh, slam some limit you know limited edition trainers quite a few of them um so yeah that is that Let's see what else i can find here actually that i've not already shown you pretty sure that is virtually it i think yeah i think that could be it it's a fair few i did have a lot more i sold I sold a lot um what I am going to show you is, if you are familiar with um, Stash, <clears throat> the graffiti artist, um, he's kind of come a little bit more into, uh, you know, mainstream at the minute with doing the uh, limited kick that he did at Complex Con, and then he also did the window display for Round Two's New York's uh, New York store. Um, but I've been following him, and I know a lot of people do and have uh, been following him for the last 20 years. So I have accumulated, obviously I've got those two trainers that I have shown you before, 
but I've accumulated quite a few of his Medicom toys as well and I've got a deck that's quite a limited one when he had his subway uh, company and I don't even know whether he still does that he might do I'm not sure um, but um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to dig out those those toys for you um, and I'll bring the kicks out again and I'll show you as a whole my stash collection um, so I will do that um, so yeah that's that that's my the rest of my uh, trainer collection so I will just recap again <laughs> I promise I won't do this every day might get a bit boring the sticker competition so the sticker bundle and the toothbrush I'm giving away that to one lucky person in the world I will put all the details down below in the description um, follow those steps enter and you may win this little bundle all at, the co at my cost so yeah so yeah I'd definitely do that um, but I hope you liked the different location I'm freezing so I've got to get out um, I will what will I do tomorrow I'm just trying to think what am I doing tomorrow I'm hoping, yeah, I should have time tomorrow to do a vlog. I've got some jobs to do, and then I've got uh, a bit of gardening that I've got to do for a customer tomorrow. So, but I will, hopefully I will put aside 10 minutes and we can have another chat. Please, please, please like and subscribe. And please also, um, you know, comment, tell me how you're doing, tell me what you're up to, and I will see you tomorrow.